Hello and welcome to another edition of Siler Design Solutions Tips and Tricks. Today we're going to cover how to customize your dashboard within the Autodesk Construction Cloud Insight portion. So what you'll want to do is make sure that you are selecting the Insight service within your BIM 360 or Autodesk Construction Cloud project. Once you do this, over on the right hand side you're going to select Customize. Now one of the nice features are you can actually set up and customize dashboards and um, be able to utilize them. Maybe it's a PM uh, who doesn't know how to operate the BIM 360 environment, the software that we're using, things of that nature. They can actually come in here, start doing measuring, changing the personal view, sectioning, all sorts of different things, even seeing all the information about the models themselves. So how do we get here? Well, we select that customize at the top right. Once we do that, we're going to make sure that that pro uh, project design is selected. You can actually go in and configure this as well. You can give it a name. You can also go through and set up that link for where that uh, model is located. And you can change this if need be. So once you have that selected, now you can also go through and add what's known as the card library. Now the card library allows you to create filters, search, but you can see that there are many different items that you can come in and search for. Now some of these are actually links that you will need accounts for. And once you have that account linked in, like maybe it's a PIX4D, you want to go look at the project, point cloud, the photogrammetry, things like that. You can actually do that with those particular links here. And you can see there are many different kinds within here. So once you're done with that, you can hit add card and you'll be able to see this information show up right within your um, dashboard. So once you're done with that, you'll go ahead and save that out. But it's nice to be able to see all of the information here. And also you get this create dashboard button. So you can actually create multiple dashboards. Maybe you want to have it just visible for yourself, all members, selected members. And this way they can also take a look at how you are creating this information as well. Hope this has helped out. Have a great day and thank you for your time.